I sent an email to Nicole and I said, Nicole, I want to know the top things that they want to know at this conference when I come to deliver this presentation. This is what you told me. I'm going to teach you the top eight ways in your book to more effectively deliver a business presentation so that you can get your audience to do what you want, so you can motivate them, show credibility, and even make more money. And I'm going to start with how to make boring topics interesting. You should know I'm going to model everything I suggest you do. It used to drive me crazy when I'd go to these conferences and people would tell me to do stuff. But they either wouldn't tell me exactly how to do it or they wouldn't show me how to do it themselves. Everything I'm going to suggest you do, including what I just did, which is called the circle of knowledge, by the way, and I'll give you the steps to it later, I'm going to model for you. And I'm going to start with these fish right here. This is called a hook. And as you know, in fishing, if you don't make the hook appealing, they don't want it. You got to do the same thing with your presentations. And the number one way that adults find hooks appealing is if you tell them why you're going to give it to them. Most people start with what? Exactly, they start with the what you're going to get. It doesn't work. Do you remember the first thing I said to you? Hi, I'm Jason Tiedek. I gave you my credentials. But then I said, I'm going to show you how to gain a competitive advantage by delivering an irresistible presentation that gets your audience to do what you want. You didn't know how I was going to do it yet. You didn't know what it was going to look like yet, but you knew why you wanted it. I was in line to buy an iPad a few years ago for my wife. And a man and I were talking in this line because it's about 100 people long. This is when they first came out. And I looked at him and I said, I see you're in line to buy an iPad. And he says, yep. I said, what does it do? He goes, I don't know. I've never seen one. You've never seen one. He goes, nope. I said, well, then how do you know you want it? Because it's going to change my life, he says to me. This is how he says it. It's going to change my life. <laughs> really? Why is it going to change your life? He goes, because Steve Jobs, I watched him present on this. And he explained to me that it's going to save me time. I'm going to get things done finally. And I'm going to be able to have some fun, too, because I get really bored during the day. He's telling me all these things. I'm like, wow, everything he's telling me is which one? Why he'd want it. Here's the practical. I want you to, for your next presentation, to take all the topics you're going to teach. And next to each one, I want you to write down whether you think it'll make your audience more successful, more happy, or have more freedom in their life. Just write an H, S, or F next to each topic. Then write down why. And then look at all those summaries of those topics, and then summarize all that in one sentence. Like, I'm going to show you how to gain a competitive advantage by delivering a presentation that gets your audience to do what you want. Doesn't that make business professionals more successful when they get their audience to do what they want? And won't it make them happier when they have that competitive advantage? And when I said that, you could hear a pin drop in here. Did you notice that? Because everyone wants it. If you, you know you did this right, by the way, if you say it and the people say, oh, I've been looking for someone like you. <laughs> That's a hook. That's the first way to make your presentations amazing and irresistible.